Hi, this is Ross Caldwell. Watch my latest interview only on Hibernian TV. Ross, thanks for joining us here on Hibernian TV. Everyone's been talking about your goal against Lies earlier on in the week. How do you feel uh, it went overall, though, your first start in the green of Hibernian? Really pleased with my first start, obviously. It is my first start, so I was a wee bit nervous going into the game, but I felt I played to the standard that was expected of me and probably done a bit more than people expected, including scoring a goal. Playing up front on your own, is that something you're used to, or how do you feel you coped overall? Well, I'm used to playing as a two, obviously, up top with Danny Hanlon, but I felt I caught well, working as a one, and playing the channels, holding the ball up for other teammates, so happy to do that again. Obviously, one of the sort of uh, apprehensions about throwing uh, a teenage striker into a match like that would be the physical aspect of it. How do you feel you cope with that? I felt I coped well. I played most of the game with my back to goal. Obviously, I haven't shield the ball between defenders and bring other people into play. I felt I kept possession fairly high, so I'm quite happy with how that went. Obviously, originally, perhaps you were scheduled to be participating in the Foil Cup, and the under-20s have done really well in your absence anyway by reaching the final that's being played tonight. But uh, you've now assimilated into first team life. How do you feel that's gone? Because I've done well, obviously, done well in training. Also, when they got the start, and then when they started, I played well, kept the ball, and I've done myself justice. And hopefully, that can continue playing in the first team. Obviously, people would be aware of, of your goals at youth team level, in particular the double against Hearts at Easter Road last year. Would you say that's been the highlight of your career so far? Um, probably not. Probably my debut. Coming on against Rangers for the highlight of my career, and I just wanted to build on that. Don't want to be playing youth football anymore. As much as I enjoyed it and done well there, scoring goals, I want to move that on to higher things. How would you sum up your working relationship with the manager Pat Fennan? Because as soon as he was installed as boss, he took an instant liking to you, and obviously that culminated in your debut against Rangers, coming off the bench for the final few minutes of that game. He's now obviously given you a start in this overseas tour. How would you sum that all up? Um, well, I'm just really grateful to him, obviously, coming in. He's a new manager, and I didn't think I'd be used because he was a new manager coming in, but he gave me a chance, and he gave me a debut that I'll never forget. And any other chance he's going to get, I'm just going to take with both hands. How would you sum up your appetite and your hunger? You mentioned there that you're, you're desperate, you're champion of the bit for a, a first-team start come the, the beginning of the SPL campaign. How would you just sum up your, your appetite for the game? I want it just as much as anybody else does. Just because I'm a younger player doesn't mean that I want to be left out. I'm just the same as everybody else. I'll be disappointed if I'm left out. But I feel as if I've done well and I should be involved in the squad when the season starts.